Hey guys, I am Foxtrot Delta, and welcome back to some more Star Trek Legacy. And today I have a Proxima refit, Excelsior class, Constitution refit, and Constitution class. Now I'm using these ships in the original series era against the Romans and against the Klingons. So it is once again a one versus one versus one, or three versus three, or however you want to phrase it. I'm not really sure because it's confusing my brain. And uh, we're in um, Akamar. We had we have five respawns, and we had like 25,000 command points. So we have the maximum amount of command points available. And so I have the uh, Romulans on hard AI, so they should be pretty hard to beat. And I was thinking about putting the Klingons on hard AI too, but then again, they're going to use a uh, Ravenous class, which is uh, very powerful. And I mean, I'm sure they're going to use it. They always do. And yeah, those things are too powerful for my taste. I do not like them. I mean, I do like them, but I don't like having to fight against them when they're on hard AI, because they're hard enough against medium AI, and I'm talking way too much about this when I really shouldn't, but you know, I like to talk once in a while. It helps to stretch my vocal cords, makes me sound way better than I actually am. And uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna shut up now. So, where is the enemy? They are probably here and here, so, or maybe they're, no, they could be here, actually. I have nothing on my radar at all. Yeah. Well, I know someone's going to eventually be over here, because that's how this map works, so. One of my ships made it over here, that's good. Setting course and uh, let's use the long-range sensors. Initiate long -range sensor scan. Didn't know what I thought that would do, but apparently nothing. So, it's a waiting game. Or is it? There are the Romulans. Setting course now. Enemy ships on tactical. Moving into All right, position. there's the enemy. And they just went through the nebula Engaging that steals target. your shield. Engaging so, target. actually, you know what? Let's stop, 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 Moving stop, stop. Let's wait for them all to go through there. Oh, we, I guess we can shoot this guy. This guy's pretty close. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. All right. Weapons free, gentlemen. Actually, I'm gonna wait until I get a really good lock. And there we go. Destroyed. There we go. They have no shields. The geniuses they are went straight through that nebula. I don't know what they were expecting to happen, but, uh, yeah. I hope they do it again, because that was nice. Okay, I think the Excelsior, yeah, he's having some issues. Let's, uh, let's help you out. standing by. On tilt up. I can do it. There we go. There we go. Let's switch to the Enterprise. So I actually love the look of the Constitution refit. It just looks so good. But you know what ship looks even better than Constitution refit? That isn't even in this game. I mean, it is. It's in the mods. But the uh, um, alternate universe uh, Constitution class from the new movies. That thing is beautiful. And I'm seeing those all, all the time in Star Trek Online now, and I'm really jealous of everyone who has one. But they're just amazing looking. Ah, uh, but I'm not going to talk about that game right now, because we're in Star Trek Legacy. And I don't really use mods. Well, actually, I don't. Not yet. I might later, in the future. When I feel comfortable, but I don't know when that'll be. So, who knows? Yeah, man. Constitution We're taking a beating. Let's just do that. Our shields can't take many more hits, Captain. There we go. Our shields are down. Excelsior to fleet. We're taking a beating. Now the shields are down on all my ships really, except for this one. Although my Proxima Refit still actually has shields, so that's actually good. And the Klingons are making their appearance. I didn't really notice it before, but yeah, they're definitely here. 
doing their fling on things. Lock on, lock on, do it, thank you. There we go, okay, next target. Nope, it's still the same target. I thought that would have destroyed him, but it didn't. Jeez. Okay, now where is the... There it is. Okay, guys, let's... Let's hit that Katinga. Now stop shooting me, I'm not interested in you. Go away. One hit that Katinga. Oh boy. Oh boy. Wait a minute. Hold on. I gotta do this now. Do it now. That was almost really, really bad. Like, really, really bad. Almost lost my Excelsior again. Who knows how many times I've lost it already. I wasn't even paying attention. There we go. He sees me now. Hey there, Klingons. Now my Constitution class is going to come under attack. Yep. By a whole host of things. Well, let's fire back. I'm not doing that bad, actually. Let's, uh, fire the torpedoes. Yeah. We're actually doing damage. I like this. Now, our shields are down, but, I mean, his shields are down, too. So, I mean, I guess it's pretty even. Okay, let's, uh, do that. Ooh, ooh. I have a slight hole in the whole back of my saucer. And my ship. Got him. Oh boy. Yeah, this ship has definitely seen better days. Anyway, let's uh, move back to the fight. We just lost the Excelsior again. He likes to explode. Jeez, stop exploding. It's not worth it. And the planet stopped us. All right. It's okay. Let's go over here, and bada boom. Sensors report Klingon ship. I got them. Work speed ahead. Enterprise complete. We're taking a beating. Romulus destroyed. All right. So we just lost our Ticonderoga, or not our Ticonderoga, our Proxima class. But I think it was called the Ticonderoga. So technically, I'm still correct. Maybe. Ticonderoga yes. standing by. All right, let's go over here. Cause that's what the battle is. To your Battles doing this stuff. A boarding warp, Captain. That sentence didn't make any sort of sense, but Enemy I'm just gonna detected. roll with it. Okay, all our ships are more or less over here. Trying to get this Katinga. There you go. Yeah, eat my torpedoes. You like that, huh? You will pay for the murderers that are on board your ships. Murdering the Federation. We've already gotten rid of the Romulans. They're gone. Pretty sure. Pretty sure it's just these Klingons. And then D3. They're the last ones. They will know pain and suffering. Okay. Oh. Two Ravenous class ships are still coming our way. Well, let's just stay here and wait. Enemy ships on tactical. Oh boy. There's more. Alright, let's um course set. Reverse our course. Target that uh Katinga. Enterprise to fleet. Yes, take my longer. Broadside phasers. I'm gonna refer to them as that from now on. The broadsides. Because they remind me exactly of that. Broadside cannons. Ooh! That was a pretty good explosion. You know, all my ships have some sort of physical damage except for this one. Like, all of them look like they have holes in them and gashes and whoa. This guy is definitely 
dead. I was gonna try to fix it, but uh, I didn't know that it was damaged, and uh, well, it's too late now. And we're out of respawn, so it's just them versus us now. And I really liked that Constitution refit. Darn it. I should have repaired it. But I did not. Those torpedoes are doing damage, not doing enough damage, so, oh boy. Okay, we have that destroyed, and, okay, so, there's what, a one, one ship out there somewhere? Where are you? Initiating long-range sensor scan. There you are. Setting course now. I see them. Captain, sensors report enemy vessel. No kidding. Proceeding to warp. Let's move toward him. Quietly. Okay, fire everything. We need to destroy them, or they will destroy us. And we will lose. Or they will lose. This is the end. I'm not getting any power to my weapons. Come on, there we go. I think we've won. Yes, I am victorious. Alright, so that was a pretty close battle. That took just under 11 minutes. I got 16 kills, lost 7 ships, so I almost lost everything, but I didn't, fortunately. And uh, our enemies lost everything they had. So, uh... If you guys enjoyed this action-packed 3 versus 3 1v1v1 battle, if you guys enjoyed this video, uh, please be sure to leave it a like. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe if you want to see more. And uh, yeah, if you guys did not like this video, I am sorry for that. Please leave a comment in the comment section and tell me what it is I can do to improve the next videos that I make so that you guys can enjoy them. And uh, as always, if you guys want to see any specific type of ship or battle scenario, also feel free to leave a comment in the comment section about that. Uh, I will read those, and I'll try to use those ideas in my future videos. So as always, I'm Foxtrot Delta, and I will see you next time. <laughs>